<clears throat> so what is up guys? I think I'm having I just think I had an epiphany. And what I mean by that <clears throat> Sorry about that, I'm back. Looking back at my videos six months ago, I literally did not have what I have today. Six months it's changed drastically. And to get to the point, referring off of those videos six months ago about me watching a video of myself and me looking at the jobs that I was doing then and what I was charging and how I was charging and approaching the customer. I'm smacking myself in the face because I'm questioning myself, why did I do that? And looking back at those videos, I, like I said, I slapped myself in the face because I'm like, why was I doing that? Why did I charge that? Look at, look at that look at that job why and I mean at the time it was better than nothing but that just shows how much you learn over a period of 6 to 12 months you look back if you're a youtuber and you're a landscaper and you look back at your videos it kind of helps sharpen your direction I'm just saying I've learned a lot my kids are being ornery again. <laughs> You're getting big, guys. Say hi to YouTube, son. You gonna, you gonna, you gonna, you gonna say hi? You gonna smack the camera? Six months ago, my couch was on the other side of the wall. Now it's on this side. I have been on my own. Business wise, I mean, I barely made it through winter, no income, don't know how I paid the bills. I really don't know how I paid the bills. Income tax returns came, we got $7,500, paid most of our bills off. I put 500 aside to invest it in a good mower. And I'm not saying how I got it, I got a hold of an X Mark Commercial 36, thanks to a family member who. I can't really say. I'm very thankful of. No, it's not hot. It's all legal. <laughs> it's, it's it's mine, legally. Don't get the wrong idea, please. Seriously. Um, I earned that. And because of that investment, which the handle broke off. I got, I'm about to pick up a new one tomorrow. Yeah, the, uh, this is not to be off topic. The X mark shift, uh, the shift levers. They're bad for breaking at the weld where the two bolts are. That activates the shaft to twist the flow bar. I call it a flow bar because it opens up the flow bar for the circulation of all the hydraulic fluid. I used to re I used to repair hydraulic units, so I I, I know. And it, it had broken off at the lever, and now I got to go pick up. I I'm gonna have. A 2016 handle because they changed the handles out well, to back to reiterate what I was saying is I look back and I'm like I, I feel so stupid and I'm still learning and you're gonna learn new things every day I don't care if you've been in this business 22 years 27 years you're still learning new trends because the newer and further in the years we get there's always something new coming out. Now you can have the whole game down pat. It's just like, here's as a comparison. Let's say you play a game online. You're an online game player. So I'd switch the camera around, but you're playing a game, right? That's, that's TV. And Call of Duty's got this new update. Oh, they changed a few things around on the map. Now the map looks even sharper and different. Oh, it's got a few new new features to it. And they've updated it. It's like you can you can be you can be gaming since the nineties. And the games are changing and getting more advanced. Same thing with the industry we are in. Not to have a weird analogy, but you get the picture comparison that I'm trying to give you here. Is I'm probably gonna look back at this video and it's, I'm probably gonna say that this is stupid too, but right now I had an epiphany, so I'm gonna stick with that epiphany until things change. Um Things are always changing, and I think that's the point of this video. 
no matter how experienced you are, something new will come out and completely make you inoperative in that section of your field. It will completely disable you because it's able to do it faster, better, more accurate than you did by hand. Just like push mowing. Everybody used to push mow. Now you've got all this newer technology machinery coming out with hydraulic systems and skid steers that's able that's more compact better high quality but it's an investment it's a market it's a trend and that's something that you need to keep in mind is no matter how long you've been doing it you could be doing it for six months and look back and say why why did i do that i'm so stupid why didn't i do it this way why did i charge that price I have a better way of charging by using cards and plastic. My, you know, There's different ways for customers to pay. All I'm trying to say is things are always changing. I don't know how much I can reiterate that. I don't know how much I can get that out to you. And for you haters, hit the door. No one cares. I don't care. But, uh, and about the haters, no matter what you're doing... You're always going to have people who will hate and criticize. This is a twisted message. I understand that. I know the message is all over the place. Step back and dissect each subject that I'm talking about. I stress this to you highly. I'm bad for jumping subjects. Now, if, you're, if you are a YouTuber that's been watching me for a while, you know what I'm talking about. I'm not going to stop making these videos. If you're negative, I'll block you. Don't waste your time. Don't waste my time. This is for the people who are new or very fresh and they don't know where to start. Um, if you're new, I recommend you to Keith Kalfas. Go check his video out. Stanley Genedek. It's S-T-A-N-E-L-Y. And then his last name is G-E-N-A-D-E-K. Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, Mario Signs. If you're on Facebook, go check him out. Good guy. Smart, knowledgeable guy. Almost near perfect lawns. Edging. He is, he's an edge guy. You'll see that about him. If you know him, like I've been talking to him for a while and I kind of know him, you'll notice that he's an edge guy. He's very picky about how his lawns are done. Go check him out. Mario Signs Landscaping. YouTube channel. Go check him out. Go subscribe. Um... What else is there to cover? I just had to get some stuff. I had to vent. I had to get some stuff off my mind. Because I was I was just scrolling through my old videos. Scratching my head and... Why was I stupid?